tall enough. Uh, let's see. All right. Now we can pull this open. A small cabinet key. Brass star. Ooh, interesting. Well, we know where the star goes. That's pretty easy. Hmm. Interesting. Go ahead and read the note. June 21st, take note of this date. It is the most significant in human history I've done it. A human subject was required. The catalyst was my own being. Fatigued by my studies, I entered the chamber without disabling the mechanism. When I regained consciousness, I had succeeded. The null element is beyond curious being neither quite energy nor matter. I've already made great strides in its study, specifically in how it refracts the light. Tonight I will open the wine. So we have a gold knight, a silver knight with a sword, and then this will go with the dial. got this mechanism here. And then we got another white knight. Okay. So let's go ahead and grab this dial. A brass ring with markings. This will go down here. with the safe. Okay. I wonder if that's what the two five symbol is for. Two on the left five on the right. Okay, two on the left, and five on the right. A large, oddly shaped key, but we've done this before. All right. Turn this key around here so I can see what's what. I 
I think that's it. Nope. So it's got a hook on the left, an S on the left, and a long one on the right. Okay, so... Oops. Well, let's turn this one around. So that bottom part is like this. The top part is like... Like that. There we go. All right. What? What are you talking about? Oh, you know what? I've got it backwards. That's why. I'm looking from the other side of the key. That's why it's not working. Okay. And then this goes all the way around this way. All right. There we go. I was looking from the other side of the key, that's why it wasn't working. Okay. A circular plate with a star emblem. Uh, let's see. That might go here. So, let's go ahead and put it here. The second seal is open, just one more to go. So this looks intriguing. Non est ad astromolis e terris. It's hard to tell what exactly, but something is missing here. Yeah, that's definitely for sure. Uh, let's look at the side here. It's some sort of... oh. Okay. It's hard to tell what exactly, but something is missing here. Some sort of astro astronomical uh, measuring device or something like that. And this is as far as I can zoom in on this section here. Okay, so this needs to go this way, but I can't turn it yet because I don't have the uh, thing. mechanisms here. Good grief. OK. 
Okay. So let's see. So this symbol I think I motioned up. And I think I've got this symbol in the correct position. Now I just have to position this one and this symbol. Then I can open up this door. But like uh, this lower right symbol. I think I've got that, yeah, in the upright position. This triangular position. That is over here. And that's in the upright position. Now there's another one with one of these knights. And I don't know if I have that in the right position. Let me check the uh, mechanism here. I think this open space on the dial is the dark marking on the uh, on these uh, wheels, which if it is, then I've got this one in the right position. So I think this dark part is supposed to be in the lower position like that. Oh, wait a minute, here's the other one. So... That's already in the right position. So I should be able to open this. Nope. Hmm. Okay. So that's what that does. So I do have to turn this box to fit the corner of the lid. Yeah, okay. So we will just turn this one like this. And that should work. All right, let's open this box. large cog and an elastic band and I guess that's it uh, let's see would this go here and the rubber band The rubber band doesn't seem to go anywhere here. <coughs> oh. So turning the handle again gives us this open compartment. A small screwdriver. <coughs> 